Hello, how are we today? So this is the second vlog update and I can tell you it has been an incredible, incredible week or two weeks. I don't really know, it's just been long. Um, you can also see that the office is filling up a little bit. I mean, we've got an iron um, with some old Domino's outfit actually, which is some good news because I quit Domino's. Um, the delivery drive thing was kind of fun, kind of awkward when you know you meet that kind of school school friend from about five years ago, and they just think, okay, that guy delivers for Domino's, great life. So that was a bit awkward, but we're getting over that. Uh, it was good means to an end. It's got me some money through the door, um, and now we've got some really exciting things coming up, and it helped pay for the Paris trip, which was amazing. Um, so we went to like three shoot locations, it was like a seven hour drive there, the ferry on the way was awful and it was like a really bad idea to open a bottle of champagne, oh, it was just with choppy weather and champagne just doesn't work. Um, and anyway, so we just smashed all the locations like, and we managed to like, get this really good photographer Jamal um, from Instagram who joined us to set up some really cool shoots. Um, had some really awesome models join us on these different locations and it was just a really fun, jam-packed day um, and just in somewhere different as well so it was really nice just to get out and we had a little team TSM so we had um, Ben doing video, videography uh, and then we had like Phil and uh, Nick doing a bit of like modelling and also just helping me sort shit out because we got down to the ferry and I booked it for the wrong week, I booked it for the week before we got to the hotel and the hotel cancelled on us and they'd let me know and I thought I'd sorted it but then instead of actually book, like saving our space because I'd actually like sent them the right details and stuff they um, they told <laughs> they told the hotel attendant if this guy comes don't let him in and so I made mean, things a little bit stressful and a little bit awkward after a seven hour drive but we smashed through um, and then we also had a fun night in Paris, which was uh, got a little bit messy. Um, and then yeah, it drove back home, um, and then it was just kind of hit the ground running. I just had that Thursday just to do all the admin and stuff, so that was really really hectic and really busy. And then as soon as that was over, Friday, Saturday, Sunday in London selling the stuff because we're just trying to get cash through the door, trying to keep it going. Um, so that was amazing, it was just amazing to be in the heart of London, selling to actual people uh, rather than like over a computer screen. Um, so that was really, really cool. And then mon m this week, Monday, Tuesday, uh, it's now Wednesday, I've just been literally sat down um, and kind of emailing people, getting different prices, ringing people up, kind of sorting stuff out. So the big news this week is we officially got the stock and signed the agreements for Crag Hoppers, which are a really, really cool company, outdoors company, so we're taking some of our backpacks there. Um, and we are on Ace Marketplace, which is so, so cool. Um, that's a little bit of a dream come true. Really, really happy about that. So, uh, every, I've just got, had so many messages from that as well, because obviously ASOS is a big name. So to be part of that in any way is really, really cool. Um, and then we're also talking to the Big Issue shop because in December we did um, a really cool thing with this little boy Jacob and he gave away hundreds and hundreds of backpacks full of stuff, like full of supplies for homeless people um, and we donated 10 backpacks to him and it was just so awesome because all these other backpacks that he donated were really boring and quite basic and then you've got ours which would brightened up the mix so that was just incredible and so that story is now going to go into the big issue um, and we're going to talk to them about selling online on, and on their platform um, because obviously we're all, all social businesses and it's really great to help each other out. Um, so yeah, so that's kind of me up to speed. Um, what's the next, uh, the next few weeks? Uh, just going to be interesting because I don't now have the money coming in from Domino's. So I've got to make sure that the sales are coming in from Social Mercenary, uh, just so I can survive. I can keep paying for this office, which is really cool. Um, 
it's by a really cool um, shoe company called Blunts, and so it's been really interesting to be close to them and to see how they do their online stuff and their online sales, etc. Um, and then how have I been feeling over the past week? Well, I've been tired, so tired last week because I just had so much going on, like obviously Paris was so much, such a lot of driving, doing stuff, and then hardly any sleep. And then Thursday I just was so stressed out because I had so much to do for that one day. Um, and then I had to get down to London the following day after a really long shift at Domino's. And so I had I finished Domino's at 11, got up at 3 just to go iron some, that's why the ironing board's here, because I actually had to sleep in the office that night. So I had to iron some clothes, pack the car up, drive down to London and be ready in London by 9 for the day's trading. Um, so that was just absolutely exhausting, but it was just good to kind of meet people and sell and yeah, to just get kind of actually feel like I'm moving somewhere. So that was so, so cool. Um, so yeah guys, um, I'll keep you updated about my movements and what I'm up to. Um, if you're part of the Social Medicine and Chief Helpers, then you'll get like a weekly like little blog thing that I'll do and then you've got these videos every two weeks. So if you want to know what I'm up to, it's really, really easy. Um, subscribe. There's also another couple of videos that I do that are just kind of points that I've learned from other entrepreneurs. So you can just check those out as well. Um, so sweet, live life on your terms and I will see you next time. Bye.